Three, two, one. Hey, Internet friend, this is Magic Brad with Synergy Cafe, the Synergy Collaborative, Synergy Ventures, and I'm out here in the woods. Wanted to do this little video to you about uh, the five questions you should be asking when you're looking into Easy One Up. And I've got a list right here. That's my technology. So first I wanted to go over uh, what Easy One Up actually is. And... Um, some a lot of people that are just looking into it what they see on the internet is it's all money 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 they they show you about how to make the money which is something you want to do if you're trying to make a living online you got to make money right but what is easy one up easy one up is a system that's uh has an income producing element to it but what's inside and the value is the videos the training videos so it's like a uh, academy it's like a uh, training, so you can learn how to your, your create your entrepreneurial mindset because that's important. If you're going to be in business for yourself, you're going to have to learn how to be resilient and, and be con uh, continuously producing and, and not being... Um, it, it's not like your 9-to-5 job where you just go in and collect a check and you go in and work and collect a check. Uh, being an entrepreneur, you got to know how to be disciplined enough to jump out of bed and get to work. Uh, you got to be able to be focused and have that discernment of go, whether to go one way or another. And so mindset is a piece of it. And um, then there's elements of how to generate traffic to your offer, whatever product or service you're promoting. You got to learn how to drive traffic to that. And it can't just be random traffic. It's got to be qualified traffic, people that actually would want to purchase that product or service. And you need to learn how to what products to pick out, and you need to learn about what platforms, like should it be Facebook or LinkedIn or Twitter or Instagram? Where are you going to be doing this marketing? Are you going to use email? Are you going to use ads, pay-per-click ads? So there's a lot to learn. Just like um, when a person goes to college and they uh, start studying a, sp a specific topic, they um, spend a lot of money to go to college. And then they learn something, and then they go off into real life and start working. So that's kind of what Easy One Up is. And like I said, a lot of people don't show you that on uh, when you're researching on YouTube and stuff because they're just showing you the money element of it. And um, I mean, like I said, there, there's you got to you want to make money if you're going to make a living, but you got to know what's in there, what's values in there. So I'm going to show you the five questions that you should be asking when you're looking into easy one up and I'll explain the answers to those questions so here's my technology that's the first question is technology so I wanted to show you the technology that you might need for uh, running this kind of uh, income producing opportunity so the technology I've got here out in the woods is I got this stick that I put across here it's just this little stick I put that on some trees that's my tripod for my phone <laughs> And here's my notes, piece of paper. So I'm not using a lot of technology here. I got a little stick. And I just balance my phone on here so that I can be hands-free. Just like that. Ta-da! And then I've got my microphone cord with a little lavalier microphone so that there's good sound quality so you can hear what I'm saying. So you can see what I'm doing, hear what I'm saying. That's my technology, an iPhone. You've probably got an a Android or an Apple iPhone. And I'm sure you got a piece of paper. So does it take a lot of technology? Not really. I mean, there are things. I have a laptop. I've got some lights and stuff like that. But you don't need them. You just got to have good lighting. So here I am. The five questions that you should be asking when you're talking, when you're looking into one easy one up. So number one is, do I need to be a techie? Not really. There's a little bit of that kind of stuff. But you can pay somebody or find somebody that can help you set things up. There's not a lot to be set up. It's a matter of getting an affiliate link, and you've probably shared stuff on Facebook before. That's what it is. It's just sharing information. And the system has a lot of the stuff that's involved in it to do the education. Similar to how you probably found this video, you clicked on something and now you're here. So do you need to be a tech techie? Not really. A little bit, but you don't need to be a, a computer technician, no. So that's number one. Number two is, how do I know this is not a scam? Well, that's an, a good question, 
and people are concerned about things being scams because there's a lot of weird crazy stuff out there on the internet because there's a lot of people on the internet and there's a lot of opportunities so that's what scammers do but so one way you don't you know that uh, easy one up is not a scam is it's been around since 2016 so there's the longevity element to it if it was an actual scam the uh, FCC or the Better Business Bureau would probably get wind of it, it would be reported, and the FBI would come in and shut them down and take their money away. That's happened before. There's businesses that have been scammy and they got in trouble. So Easy One Up's still around, and the, the thing is that there are legitimate products. It's the trainings that I mentioned before, and you have to have these trainings and things for it to be a legitimate business. Otherwise, it's just a money game, and that would be a scam where they're just trying to take your money and give it to somebody else and then give you nothing for your, your money. But Easy One Up provides you with education and a system for you to be compensated and for you to be educated. So it's got that, that element in there. It's just like a goal, you put money into a college. Is a college a scam? Some people say it is. But uh, college is very expensive. Um, Easy One Up is not at all expensive. And it goes up in, a, in an ascending level. You can invest more and you can get more return. That's just the law of nature, law of return. So that's number two. Is it a scam? I don't believe, I don't believe it is a scam. And some people that uh, get into it and they have a bad experience, they might go, scam, scam. It's not a scam. It's been around for 20, so since 2016. And there's good information in there. I've seen it to play the videos and you know, learning about different things. There's a, everything from the beginner level all the way up to the advanced. We get more and more detail, just like college. So, number three. I don't have many followers. Can I still get sales? The answer is yes. You actually don't need a lot of followers. And the, the reality is we don't want you chasing your friends and family and trying to, trying to get them into something you're into. That's just not the thing to do. I mean, if you bought a McDonald's franchise, would you run around to all your friends saying, hey, you should buy a franchise? No. <laughs> so you want to find new people that have an interest in the product or service. And uh, so do you need a lot of followers? No, you want to get new followers that are interested in what you have to offer. In fact, every product and service is going to have a different group of followers. I mean, people that are interested in running shoes may not be interested in fly fishing equipment. So you want to find a new audience, a different audience. So no, you don't need uh, to have a lot of followers. So number four, number four is, can I make enough? Because people are concerned about that. They put their time and energy into this. Can they make enough money back to make it worth their time and energy? So can you make enough? First off, what is enough? Are you looking to just uh, make a couple hundred bucks here and there so that you can go on vacations and maybe go out to dinner? Or are you looking to do this full time and replace your current nine to five job? Or are you looking to escalate it up and buy a Lamborghini and a private jet? So depends on what enough is to you. Now, yes, you can make enough because Easy One Up is just one way to start making the income. There's other programs and platforms and products and services that you can sell that when, once you start learning and understanding how to uh, get affiliate links and put them out to the right audience and people purchase that product or service. Speaking of private jets, I think there's actually an affiliate program for people that want to rent private jets. So can you imagine that fee is fairly significant, the commission's probably significant also. So there's a lot of different things that you can sell that you can learn about in the Easy One Up uh, educational element. You can learn how to do this and you could start making more and more and more money, depending on how you want to work and what you want to sell. You know, selling candles is one thing, selling uh, Learjet rental is another. So depends on what you want to do. So yes, you can make enough, but it depends on where you position yourself and, and posture yourself. So that's number four. And number five, I'm busy. Will I have the time? Well, we've all got 24 hours in a day, right? So it depends on where you allocate your time. Are you spending time binge watching Netflix? Or are you spending your time in bed sleeping? Or are you spending your time going to the bar? Or are you spending time building your list and doing uh, promoting your product or service? So. 
you are busy, but are you allocating your time in the right spots that's going to end up being, are you doing revenue producing activities? Or some people call them income producing activities, IMP, I am, IMA, or <laughs> IPA, income producing, that the VOJ, he d d talks about that. Sorry, lost my train of thought. But income producing activities, because you're not getting paid to watch Netflix. So. You're busy, will you have the time? It depends on where you allocate your time. Like I said, we've all got 24 hours in a day. Where are you gonna spend your time? So you do, you do have time, it's just a matter of where you're spending it. And granted, if you got that nine to five job, this is gonna be a side hustle thing, so it's gonna take a little more, uh, little more uh, time because you've, you've spent it all on, on your nine to five job. So that's part of the goal. If you wanna leave your nine to five job, you wanna find something, that uh, a new stepping stone that you can step on to to earn that living so that you can leave that nine to five job if that's what you want to do. Like I said, it's possible that you want to build this up on the side and just uh, do a little sideline business where you're making some money and learning about uh, education. People are learning about stuff all the time. They're on the internet looking things up and learning about things. Why not learn about something that's going to actually start producing you a return on your time investment and your, your financial investment? So, that's the story, Morning Glory. These are the five questions. I'll go over them one more time. Number one, do I need to be a techie? Not really. Um, you're doing a lot of the stuff anyways. You're posting and commenting and all that stuff anyways. So, how do I know this is not a scam? Well, it's still here. And there's a lot of different things out there that some of these things are scams. And There's people that say that the the government economy is a scam and there's people that say that uh, you know uh, capitalism is a scam there's a lot of people that have opinions about scams um, this is still around I've been in it um, I've seen what's inside uh, <laughs> I don't think it's a scam number three I don't have many followers. Can I still get sales? The answer is yes. You want new followers. You want people that are actually following you to learn about your product, service, or cause. So, number four, can I make enough? Define what enough is. If you think about it, if you can earn $1 more than your monthly outgo, you are financially free. So, if, you, if, you've, if your expenses, your monthly expenses are we'll say $5,000 a month. If you can make $5,001 a month, you are financially free. There you go. So, number five, I'm busy, will I have the time? You have just as much time as I've got, 24 hours in a day. So it depends on where you're allocating your time. Anyways, friends, that's all I've got for now. Peace, love, and happiness. This is Magic Brad with Synergy Cafe, the Synergy Collaborative, Synergy Ventures, and this is all about easy one up. If you want to know more about it, you can click the links below or above or wherever they are or just Google the keyword Magic Brad and contact me and I will help you out. Okay, peace, love, and happiness. Magic Brad signing off. Thanks. Bye.